All right, so today we are going to be unboxing all of this. That's my foot. And we're going to be completely renovating the setup. So without further ado, let's get started. So first off, we have this box. And if you can see, this is not tech related, but I had to get a book because I always do. And this one is Permanent Record by Edward Snowden. And I recently watched uh, Joe Rogan's podcast um, from 2019. And it's very interesting. I think I watched it twice now. This is his uh, book that he wrote in 2019. So this will be going on the shelf. So let's get into the next thing. And I got a PS Vita carrying case. And I got this because I have an Aqua Blue um, PSV 2000, PS Vita 2000, and I don't have a proper case for it. And I don't want to get to, I've had it for a long time now, but I've just been using like an old DS case, but for presentation purposes, went ahead and picked up this case, which looks pretty sweet, so. Man, this box was a pain to open, but my weapon of choice today is my handy dandy keys, so. I guess that 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 could probably complicate things, but in here we have one hand. We have a desk webcam mount, so you'll be see how I'll be incorporating this later. So in here we have my hard drive, which is a two terabyte. I think it's a Barracuda hard drive. And this is just because I want to switch out hard drives because my other one is a little bit too noisy. So I'm just going to swap out this two terabyte with my other one. All right. This is my dual monitor desk mount. This right here is the bread and butter. And I think this is going to really bring the new renovation together because I'm going to mount two monitors to this right under my tv that's me and i'm going to completely get rid of those two stands this is the biggest box that i received so far and this is what is this well this is my uh, condenser microphone this is one of the best selling ones on amazon so it's pretty easy to find it it's tonor this is this comes with the with the arm mount and it comes with the microphone and it really just comes with everything that you need right off the bat. It was some good reviews on this for the price point. I don't think you can probably beat it, so hopefully it's quality. And here I got an anchor um, USB multiplier. This is just, you know, plug it in. I get four um, USB 3.0 ports, I believe, because I have so many USBs now with all the things in my setup that I'm just completely out. So this will be very useful for setting all this up. And lastly, these are video conference lights, or, you know, just, just O-ring lights, just to help the quality of the videos, because shadows are not good. So, as I speak of that shadow, but this will really boost up the quality of your videos. Here we have my webcam, because I currently don't have one. And this is just um, the standard uh the one that everyone usually has is the C922 Pro. I believe it was um, about 70 bucks. Okay, and in this box we have, let's see, I was ready to go. What is that? Oh, it's a new CPU cooler. I think it's just a fan, a CPU fan. I got one of these because I built my PC a long time ago before the mining craze before the prices of gpus went through the roof but i only have an intel cooler so i was just like i might as well just go ahead and just change it out so in here we have what is this okay what is this oh i thought something else in there this is i think that this is my grip I'm gonna open this up later. 
I'll show you guys. This right here is um, thumbstick risers for my PS Vita because they're just so low. Like I'm really starting to get back into my using my Vita again. So, cause I usually, I haven't used it in years, but recently I've been playing it. So I got some of these and I think that this is a grip for it as well, but I'm gonna open this up and show you guys. So actually this isn't for my Vita. This is for my 2DS. I forgot I ordered this, but I uh, I saw this um, um, this one item on there when I was looking for grips for my Vita, and I have a 2DS uh, XL. I got the Pokeball edition, I think so. But I saw this grip, and it came with the grip, and it came with a, it came with a docking station that you can charge. So I'll be try. I'm gonna try to incorporate like all of my gaming systems into the new setup area, kind of make it easy and accessible for whenever I want to play them. Right, this is my last uh, package that I have, and this has. Let's see. Uh, which is that? This is packaging. But it looks like this is. Okay, this is a new, um, I, my motherboard doesn't have wireless, so I have to use a USB wireless thing. And this is just to upgrade from my old one because my other one is really old. So this will just, you know, just an upgrade. That's all that is. Now, this looks like my Vita Grip. Is that the right color? Yeah, I guess that's blue in there. Yeah, but this is the Vita grip that I got. It's just probably from some like Chinese manufacturer. <laughs> but, but that is all. I'll show you guys some of the accessories, like um, the design that I'm kind of going for. I got some uh, plants and lighting ideas, and I will show you guys those. These are the plants that I got. I decided I decided on artificial plants because I knew I wasn't going to take care of the real plants. I know they're going to die pretty fast. Uh, don't ask me how I know, but I'm going to use those artificial plants to kind of you know liven it up the the area over there. And I have this little kind of like novelty lamp that I kind of want to incorporate. It has a warm light in there uh right now i have a warm light uh as my overhead light but i'm going to keep this warm light in there and i'm going to um my overhead light i want it to be a more brighter kind of more productive light you know kind of more not industrial but you know just a higher uh a higher whatever you call it k temperature whatever they call it but that is what i'm going to be using so now I'm going to tear down the setup and then we're going to get started. This is how the setup is currently looking. I haven't cleaned. I haven't changed anything. This is just how it normally looks on a given day. So I have my TV because my bed is behind me. So I usually I can just pull that TV out and it just completely like goes in front of the setup and it just erases it when all the lights is off and it's black so you won't really see it. And here I have just two monitors. This is a monitor that I stole from downstairs a long time ago. Uh, this is a new monitor. It's just a 60 Hertz. It's just a Samsung, one of the Samsung models. It's curved 27 inch. This is usually my main monitor, and this is just a secondary monitor. Back there, I have my Switch, which just, um, those are uh, third-party uh, Joy-Cons. A really cool figurine that I've had since since I was a little kid. Um, Joy-Cons, that's the same cup holder, because don't put your cups on your desk. A, a candle there, got my Apple Watch, my LED. Um, controller i'll turn them on for you this is how the leds currently look i don't have to add leds this is just already part of the setup this is just a renovation so and if you're wondering this is my workhorse that's the galaxy tab s7 and it's a beast i really love that thing because it's like it's a tablet it's a laptop it can do really everything i need 
down here i have my pc looking pitiful in the corner over there and i have uh hp i got this like two or three years ago it it can scan copy all of that so that's really good to have um at the home setup and over here i have a wireless charging station those are my uh samsung uh, galaxy buds back there and that's just where i just charge my iphone i just plop it on there wherever i'm sitting down and get a quick charge this is a mechanical keyboard that i got a long time ago it's tech where i don't even know if they still make keyboards this is just a logitech hero i don't know the the exact model but other than that that's the current setup and this is a chair that i looked out and i found this chair and it's relatively comfortable and I literally only spent about 60 bucks. That is the current setup. So I'm gonna go ahead and tear this down. I'm gonna pull everything out. So I've completely gutted the setup here. Uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get my PC area cleaned up, get those cables in order and everything, untie those and all that. Then I am going to clean off my desk and clean off some of my peripherals first, dust them off, clean them off and whatever. And then I'm going to install my mount, uh, my mounting arm for my microphone, my mount for my webcam. And I think that's pretty much it. And then I'll come back and update you guys on the process. So yeah, coming together. Oh, and I forgot to mention I don't know how I forgot. My headphones that I use are still series. Like I said again, I forget the exact model, but this is what they look like. These are very good. I really enjoy these. They got good sound quality and good mic quality. All right, I am finally done with the mount. It took a little bit too long. It took like an hour, but that was because the instructions and the parts did not match up, but we got it all together, we got it looking good. So now, next up on the list is we're going to install our CPU fan and our hard drive. So I'm gonna go ahead and hop to that. All right, so this is what I have so far in terms of the setup. I have everything done so far except for the computer. I haven't made any progress. Today I'm gonna call it here because I have to go handle some things. So. I'm gonna call it a day for right now. But so far the setup is coming together. All right, I am finally done with the room. I finished upgrading my PC. I have my corner set up. I have my room set up. This is honestly, I think the best my room has looked in a while considering all the things that I want are incorporated into my space. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick couple of pan around shots and let you guys see. And yeah, I really like it. So this is the corner where I sleep. This is under 
the cool lighting, the new lighting source that I have. All right, so this here is my reading corner. I just have three tall shelves pushed up against each other, making an L. This is my current collection of books. Uh, in the future, I do want to do a bookshelf tour, but I really want to fill out my shelves first. So that probably won't be until next year. But yeah, this is my reading corner. I really like it how it looks right now. And then my most important corner, my work, gaming. This is like the corner that I spend the majority of my time. Probably too much of my time. But this is how I have it set up right now. You can see how I incorporated those fake plants into the wall there. Each um, item that I have on that shelf is something that I'm going to be grabbing constantly. Like over here, I have um, my grips for all my handheld systems. And up there, I just have the other Joy-Cons for the Nintendo Switch. And I have my Xbox Elite controller right now in there. But I'm currently using this white controller, but to be honest with you guys, I'm really only using it because it's a good contrast with the rest of the setup that I have. But in the future, I might just end up use, using my own um, Elite controller because I'm so used to the paddles. So yeah, this is how I currently have the setup. And I'm really uh, happy with it. It turned out really nice. I really like how I incorporated the plants. I have all of my um, gaming systems over there incorporated into the space. It just, to me, it looks really sleek and clean. And not only is it sleek, but it's actually functional to me because I already know this is probably how it's going to stay. I'm not too much of a junkie person, so. This is probably how it's gonna end up besides that Xbox controller. I'm probably gonna end up switching that out, but other than that, yeah. Oh, and one more thing I wanna show you guys is my door lights. I'm gonna turn off the light here. And you can see how it's probably will look at nighttime when I'm just sitting here working or playing games. But over here, I have these lights set up around the door. So I guess this is the last corner, huh? but that's my closet there to the right. But I really like how that looks. This is a really cool, but yeah. So let me jump to the outro. All right, so that was my um, setup. Well, renovation and I guess room tour. <laughs> yeah, well, four corner room tour. But yeah, uh, this build was, uh, very hectic because these past couple of days have been very packed on for me but um i finished the setup today so and things are calming down in my life so i'm really hoping for a good summer uh, if you guys don't know i am a full-time student i'm um, an engineering student uh, i just finished my first year so congrats to me i guess but yeah, so uh, this summer I'm just going to be working and I'm going to try to get um, more YouTube content out because I think that this is something that I want to do, but I don't know. We'll see. You'll see videos if you see videos. Who knows? <laughs> I'm not making any promises, but yeah, if you cannot tell, I'm a huge reader. I can see my books. So this channel will be incorporating that. I do a whole lot of gaming, um, a whole lot of like coding stuff. I do, I have a lot of varying interests. So you'll see probably a little bit of everything on this channel. I'll try to keep it centered around me. Maybe a vlog style, maybe a live channel. I don't really know, I don't know. But yeah, this has been my setup renovation. So I hope you guys have a good morning, afternoon, evening, night, wherever you are in the world. And always remember to be better than yesterday. And you guys have a good one. Peace.